Use the method of reduction of order to find a second solution of the given ordinary differential equation. So we have a second order differential equation and first solution is given here t squared. Now we need to find a second solution using the method of reduction of order. Okay, And the second solution will be should be linearly independent to this okay not constant times this function so the hard work is done when we derive this formula okay so when we have y double prime plus p t y p y prime plus q y equals zero t positive and if y1 is the first solution then second solution will be first solution times this integral of this quotient e raised to negative pt dt over y1t this first solution is square dt and this is without negative sign this is pretty much the integrating factor I mean that used to be in the left side when we move to the right side that's why negative sign okay so to find to make use of this formula we need to put this differential equation in this form so only y double prime that means we need to divide through by t squared and t is positive so we can divide okay so let's divide that divide by t squared the ODE ordinary differential equation is if you after dividing by t squared we have y double prime minus 4 over t y prime plus 6 over t square y equals 0 and pt is negative 4 over t if you compare with this this a p function is negative 4 over t and first solution is t square then the second solution then a second solution is first solution t square times this uh, first solution is square so t is square is square so we can write t square is square t to the fourth on the top e raised to negative p t so p is in this case negative 4 over t and that negative with this negative this just becomes positive okay so that's 4 over t dt an integral of everything dt which is here do not cancel this because this is inside integral now integral of 4 over t is pretty much 4 outside and 1 over t antiderivative of 1 over t is natural log of t t is positive so we don't need absolute value and that's t a 4 goes there so natural log of t fourth so this is e raised to natural log of t fourth and we know that e raised to natural log of anything is just that so e raised to natural log of t fourth e and natural log their actions cancel t fourth on the top is t fourth over t fourth dt they cancel just one so t squared times okay integral of one is just t plus some constant of integration distribute this so this is t cubed plus t squared c or c times t squared and we're asked to find a solution a second solution uh, in fact if we take c equals zero then this is gone so t cube will be a second solution in fact t squared is already a first solution so we can remove this or take c equals 0 either way t cube you can just write t cube or this t cube is a second solution final